All right, we got a treat for you guys this morning. We are here with a couple of uh, business owners. I'm going to let them introduce themselves. Uh, good okay. morning to you. Good morning, sir. How uh, are you? All right, how, tell, tell us your names and uh, the business that you, tell us a little bit about your okay, business yeah. too. My name is uh, Carlos Campos, okay. uh, my wife, Luz Campos, and the uh, name of our business is La Michoacana Odessa. So as you can see, uh, we serve uh, paletas, which basically means uh, ice cream pops. Ice cream and uh, and uh, fruit infusion uh, blended water, basically. Okay. Aguas frescas. Yes. So sir. I'm excited because I've never had anything like this, but it all looks delicious. But let's jump into the interview, then maybe afterwards we can do a little taste test here. Yes, sir. If you guys don't mind. Absolutely. Um, so what made you guys decide to even want to open up a shop like this? Well, this kind of started way back when, about 19, 20 years ago, as a coffee shop idea. Oh. And along the way, you know, for different reasons, uh, didn't happen. And then uh, here in the last couple of years, pre-COVID, we met uh, some, some friends that have these type of uh, uh, eateries, uh, mm -hmm. Mexican type of cuisine, if you will, uh, in South Texas. So we kind of started thinking, a, you know, here in this area of Permian Basin, it's kind of lacking a lot of ice cream shops, authentic yeah. stuff. And so it kind of morphed into what it is now. Okay. And if you guys are hearing a lot of static at home, it's just the gloves that you have on. So it's not your TV <laughs> Sorry, guys. It just No, it's fine. It's fine because uh, I'm going to put some on too so we can get right into it because, like I said, it looks really, really, really good. Yes, sir. But um, so tell us about the snacks that you guys sell. Okay. Uh, of course, it starts with the, uh, the sweets, uh, which is, again, popsicles, uh, fruit infused water. Okay. Uh, we do uh, a special blend of nachos. You know, now these uh, the taste buds are a little bit different for a younger generation. They'll have uh, Dorito nachos, Taki oh. nachos, they'll do Frito nachos, we do Ruffle nachos, that kind of stuff. Then we'll do um, some shrimp cocktail, um, mm -hmm. pipe of prepared uh, with our own kind of recipe there. Uh, then we get into um, even uh, chocolate dipped bananas. We get into other kind of desserts. Mm -hmm. uh, and then uh, we get some specialties kind of out of uh, authentic Mexican, like called chilindrinas, which is a, you know, it's, a, uh, it's an authentic type of pork rind that has a lot mm -hmm. of... Um, uh, veg veggies on it and jalapeno, that kind of stuff on there. So it's... Uh, a lot of that sounds good. Um, but tell me about what we have here on the table. Okay, so today what we brought was uh, our different blend of uh, what we call paletas, basically popsicles with, uh, with fruit blends, right? So uh, okay. we make this special one actually uh, out of uh, Ferrero Rocher, right? Which is that candy that's uh, very popular. Oh. So we take our own mixture, make it into a recipe, and then okay. so we make not only... That's uh, one of my favorite candies. Uh, yeah, not only ice cream, but we also make uh, paletas, popsicles, right? So it's one of our... Uh, our highest selling, mm -hmm. uh, most demanded, and we have um, uh, Pecos cantaloupe uh, popsicles. We'll, so we'll take a Pecos cantaloupe and mm -hmm. do our thing with it, even create uh, right here uh, fruit infused water mm -hmm. uh, or ice cream uh, and or popsicles, right? So it's got, uh, you know, Pecos cantaloupes are are a treat every year, you know, for about a month, month and a half. So we take advantage of that and, and get some good uh, crops out there. And, and so we work with, uh, get it from local farmers, right? So, so tell me, so we have, uh, it looks like we have one, two, three, yeah. four, five different flavors here. Yeah. Um, we carry about, I don't know, close to about 25, 30 different flavors. What's your uh, most popular? Uh, kiwi strawberry is a, a popular one for uh, Ferrero Rocher. Now cantaloupe in that season, then we do a lot of things with chamoy, and, which is a different kind of spice, and pineapple. So anything you can think of, we can possibly blend. So we are running out of time here, but I do want to try one. Yeah. Which one should I try? Uh, I'd say the Ferrero. The Ferrero. All yeah. right. So right this one. Yeah. All right, here we go. So um, while I open this and everything like that, just tell us how people can uh, find more information about your business and, uh, and uh, where you guys are located and how people can uh, okay. come see you. So we're located at uh, 200 Walmart Court, which is essentially the west side of Odessa Walmart near that area. And, and uh, so you'll see us in that little shopping corridor uh, on the south, south end of Walmart. And uh, so we're in between two, uh, two big places there. Uh, T-Mobile and GameStop. So you'll find us in between there mm -hmm. and we're open Tuesday through uh, Sunday, 12 to 9 and on Sundays 12 to 8. So uh, again, come see us. We have all kinds of treats and and uh, so look at this guy. I think he's enjoying it, right? So <laughs> it speaks for itself. The products do speak for itself. So again, uh, right. come see well, us. Well, I, I got my mouth full here, um, but I'm going to try to read this. Thank you so much for being here. Thank By you. the way, thank you for these paletas. If you can find more information on uh, yourbasin.com.